everyone welcome back to my channel hope you're all doing well so I did a thing um, I think I said a while ago that um, I'd ordered some click pens fountain pens and then that the pilot catalyst came up on Facebook and then I got that as well so I've been using I've been using the catalyst as well but it keeps stopping if that makes sense I don't know it stops writing I don't know if the nib is clogged if it's dirty I don't know because it was a used pen and I did I did clean it all rinsed it out whatever but um, I think it's still clogged or or it could be the converter because I have to keep winding the converter it's just not getting ink so I'm going to clean it all anyway, but anyway, I got this one first. This is the first one that arrived and it's a purple. It says Moon Man, which is really cute. I, I like that. And it's the, the A2 one. Uh, so it's the newest one. It's, um, what do you call this? Faceted? It's not completely round. So it's just the same as a Capless. Um, and... I had it for about a week and I was checking the nib and everything because I'd watch videos and the only problem that people had with these cheaper capless pens was that they would leak at the top here, the nib. And I hadn't seen it for a good week or two and until yesterday, I think it was. I, I hadn't written for it for a day, I think. I hadn't used it. And I'd popped her out and there's ink on here which was unusual because it hadn't happened before and there it is there's the ink on the nib so yes okay it's a problem so I will have to clean all that um, I will wipe all that down and clean inside the housing here um, and then I will get some silicon grease and just wipe around there like I saw on the video. So I will do that and see if it works. Okay, back to this one. Uh, this is a bit different. This is like the cheapest one that I'd seen. They had pretty colours, but I have pink ones, I have blue ones, I have green ones, I have, you know, I have colours. What I don't have is like a more neutral, this is like a khaki I don't know it looks like baby cack you put it all together it's just not my colors at all so a little bit out of my comfort zone with the colors it's kind of like a darker mustard color and this this color is nice it's like a it's like a beigey latte or something anyway it has a really nice clip on it um but it doesn't you know it's very tight there's no give what you could say see here where it would lift up but you can slip a piece of paper under there no worries you know it will slip on anyway so it also comes with a little plastic cap at the bottom don't know if if we need to keep that or not not sure and then it clicks out so it's the smallest smallest of nibs I don't know if you can see that. I don't even know if I've got it right in the right spot. Tiniest, tiniest little nib. They are extra fine. All these clip pens that I've got, um, these cheaper ones, are extra fine. So, okay. So I've got this one. One of my other pens that I got a while ago came with these cartridges. So I'm going to try one of these in this pen i don't feel like inking up the cartridge to be honest with you so i want to be lazy and i'm just going to chuck one of these in i am a little bit concerned however because i'm so used to the pilot inks they're very wet inks they're very um they're very nice inks I don't know what this ink is. I don't know how juicy it is. I don't know. 
um, and with this being such a fine nib, extra fine, um, I don't know how nice it's going to write. But anyway, I guess I'm not going to know if I don't try it. So I told myself I wasn't going to ink up any of these pens. They all come with a little converter. But I don't, like I said, I don't want to ink that up. So I'm going to put this in. And hopefully it fits. Mm. I don't know actually because hmm I guess it wouldn't matter because uh, it's probably not gonna fit hey because that's that length and because it's got a click dang I didn't think of that So that might not be long enough for this pen. Bugger. I didn't even think of that. What's this one? It's even shorter. It's a Quapo. Alright. So scrap that. I can't put that in there. I don't even know why I thought I could, to be honest. Alright. I'm going to pause and I will fill this up and I'll come back. Okay, I'm back. I couldn't find my syringe. So I've got... Can I have that bottle? That. Yeah. This one, the Pilot Yero Shizuku Fuyu Sayo Gum. Sayo Gum? I probably butchered it, but just a black well I hope that's in there yep. All right I'll just clean it not successfully and I will just go to here somewhere and right in here so this purple one is this one here the Moonman extra fine and then I actually did the Quakos and this one here, this black, was the pilot. I tried to write pilot. Catless. Didn't work. So, yeah, I don't know. These, um, I love my Quakos now. These new ones that I got. The green, the pearl, iridescent pearl. And then these two were the um, Perkios. Perkio. Um, and I absolutely love this one despite the fact that it's leaking inside i do love it still the way it writes um it's just really nice Ooh. okay that doesn't look good i don't even know what these are called um Deep cats, <laughs> it'll do, um, in extra fine. So that's not a dark black, um, and it dries to a grey, which, which I think is fitting for this, and it's dry already. Well, well sort of. Okay. And it's really nice. I'll just I'm just looking to see if it's not leaking anywhere. So far. So far so good. I love how these inks are. 
it's really nice it dries to a gray very nice so that's that one it's not as fine as i thought it would be either so i was i was a bit worried about that and this one actually this one's finer than that one Hmm. Anyway, I do love all my little capless pens. So I was going to keep this one, maybe with this book, because I use, this is just a ballpoint, this is from Planners Anonymous, um, from the sub boxes. I, I'm a bit weird. I actually do like ballpoint pen on this paper, Tomorrow River paper. I'm a little heavier handed with a ballpoint pen than I am with a fountain pen or a gel pen. I'm quite light handed with an inky pen. With a ballpoint, I tend to push harder. And I don't know. Um, maybe that is ballpoint. These bits here, ballpoint. Um, maybe these are. This isn't. This is all fountain pen that's fountain pen fountain pen um yeah i don't know i i like how the ballpoint pens um like well this is ballpoint pen this is this pen this and this um and this i think it I don't know, it's like it, it indents the um, paper. So this is all um, fountain pens. It sits on top. It's beautiful, nice and bright. But when I use ballpoint, it tends to, like, I don't know, it's lighter. But I, I push harder and then, I don't know, like, you can feel it more on the opposite side. Or whatever and it crinkles more i feel i don't know maybe it's just me anyway so that is my that i wasn't here for this one but i thought bring this back in i thought this might go with this i could either clip it here but then i'm a bit worried about losing this little cap i don't know if it really matters because it is in there anyway so I don't really know but I'll, that was a thought anyway of keeping this pen with this planner because I like a brown kind of this is a bit bright but it still looks good because it's a purple book I don't keep this with it I keep this at home I carry this one with the book anyway guys thank you so much for watching that was my just a little cheap capless pen um, they're not all cheap and nasty, I guess. Thanks for watching, guys. Bye.